Hi, Nick Collier here, and this is my shop. Come join me. We'll have okay, some fun. We're just a bit undersized, and I think what I can do is go ahead and turn. Oh, it's just a bit undersized. Is just turn some of the threads off of this and and push it through, and that way I'll have a a seat for it to sit on. So now what we want to do is come in. I'm not going to be able to do it with this bit. <clears throat> Come in and create a seat for the back side of this. Something like that. Let's see what that looks like. Okay, that looks pretty good. I like it. Yeah, a little bit of a sharp edge under there, maybe with just a little file work. Let's take it over to the uh, mill oh, okay. case. So I kick the head over. You know, I, I always really fight myself to not do that. And, you know, because I hate bringing it back and messing around with it. And yet it took me 10 minutes to set this whole thing up. So I just have to kind of get over that. So we're all set up. We're going to flatten our uh, bosses on three sides to come back in and drill a hole and then come back in and and run tap uh, run a tap down in there yeah, that might work. Well, that's good for that. Now the problem is, is I haven't got enough room to get in there to get a drill bed in. So, either we're gonna drill it with collets or we're gonna have to reset. And I'm thinking reset would be the better deal. Something like that. Of course, I can't reach it now. No, I can reach it. There it is. Okay.
so as you can tell I didn't take it down far enough. So let's take it down further. That might do the trick. Nick, how close do you want to get to this size? Right on it? Uh, yeah, some someplace close. Real close to it? Yeah. Not any bigger. Okay. At least uh, smaller than it. Two thirds. You get one or two turns in, and then uh, if it's starting to bind up, then you know that you've. Yeah. Oh my God! What happened to this drill bit? So I, I pierced it all the way through into that hole so it, it will be easier to tap. You're looking like Hollywood. East LA, actually. East LA, right. Do you meet Jason? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Good to see you. Hey, Cool. Let me uh, turn off the camera. All right. Well, uh, we're back to this. It's uh, about four o'clock in the morning. I need to get this done and off of here because we've got another project coming in. So I'm up early cranking. All right, we've got it. So now let's take this off or out. Blow it off. Okay, we've taken it off. Now we've got our basic hub. And now all we need to do is, uh, well, we want to cut it off and then uh, square up the back side 
and then do we just need to make the handles and then get it to fit the uh, the um, shaft and weld it or the screw and weld it so that's done for now and we'll be back Okay, that looks pretty good. I think we can get something out of that. Okay, so we've got this set up. Uh, all we really want to do is just come in and square up that inside edge. And I need to make sure that I'm good. And let's put a little more angle on that. There we go. Yeah, it's a little further off than I want it to be. For some reason. Oh, I see. The washer is not square up against the up against the chuck. So let me go get a bigger washer and I'll be right back. Okay, we got just a little bit of a miss right there. We're gonna take a second pass. And that should straighten it all out. just a little bit of chamfer on that edge not that it's sharp that's good enough well since we're here we may as well go ahead and and uh, take the uh, the little bit of a shoulder that we have and it looks like we're going to take this most of the way down and I think it's just a, just a little bit let's just see yeah, that's it right there. We might even bring it back a couple of thou.
that looks pretty good. Can we get it on a little further? Yeah, I'd say that's good. And then we just come in and do a little TIG welding right in there. And that should take care of it. Okay, so we're going to come in and put some threads on these ha these potential handles. And, uh, hey, let's do that. just come in make that just a little bit longer and just take it off from where it's at all right so now we just put our die in and crank it in while moving this towards it to keep it square lock in our back gear until we get around maybe a couple of turns And we can just back this off and continue. All right, that bottomed out. Loosen it up and reverse. Now we just flip the belt off. Now reverse. And we've got ourselves some threads quick threads now we've done it to the other side but we need three so I'm just gonna cut this in half well maybe a little bit of a, more like a third and then uh, we'll thread this in and then we've got our three and we can go from there all right let's do our third one And what we want to do is get all of these fairly even. And that one looks pretty good. So we're going to just cut this off. Right about there. All right, so we're going to grip it right about there. So I want to just kind of clean up that that little surface right there
start we just clean up that one little surface where I'm gonna grab it all right now we can put this in there about like that and I'll tell you what I'm gonna do is go ahead and take a pen and mark it we're just going to mark the chuck And that should give us what we want. Now, we want to bring our, and probably, let's, uh, let's film that. Well, we're not going to be able to catch the whole thing, but we've got the taper attachment here. And what I want to do is reverse the taper. So, pretty easy thing to do at least with this taper attachment loosen my two bolts and bring it in the other direction so doing the taper at uh, attachment is the funnest when you don't have a specific angle in mind and you just like randomly uh, willy-nilly uh, set it up <clears throat> So that's what we're trying this time. I've got some micro number three centers, so they'll be able to do this as long as my chuck will grip them. Yep, it's gripping. And that'll just give us a little bit of support. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Back it up a little bit. And we'll come in and just chamfer that whole front top edge. Okay, we're going to come in and just clean up this whole thing. Hi, honey. Um, so you're going to the to the <clears throat> Today, yeah. <clears throat> okay, so uh, we've got this. I just need to chamfer that just a little bit. And then we're going to come in with a file and just clean up that, that, uh, the surface. Not bad, not bad at all. Now let's come in also 